is up guys it's soul bash welcome back we're gonna play some more mobile legends today but first i want to talk to you about a few things we're gonna be running some contests weekly now i've done this previously but on a smaller scale i quit sharing the link but there will be a link in the description you can download it it's gonna open up an app basically just download the app and you pretty much are gonna be able to save up currency to be able to buy either Google Play or iTunes for your specific region now there's gonna be different ways to enter there's gonna be a link below click on that link it should be a gleam link uh, you're gonna have different ways by just watching the videos subscribing to my channels following me on Twitter retweeting tweets and following me on Facebook, things like that. Those are gonna get you entry points to be able to win these. We're gonna run them for a week solid. So they're gonna to start today and they're gonna end Friday, probably right at midnight. All right, let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so we're gonna be using Rafaela today. Gonna to go support region. Um, basically the reason I'm gonna be doing this is to try to boost myself. We're gonna go with the execute style um, and let's go burst damage now her abilities of course everyone has a passive and her ultimate is holy baptism basically it's a single line stun that goes out and it does damage as well and it's a two second stun pretty useful for a healer of course you're gonna have the healing spell the initial cooldowns nine and a half seconds but it does go down pretty low after you get some cooldown reduction items and of course you got a damage dealing which is aoe it's going to hit multiple things which is pretty nice all right here we go we are first going to start out with picking up the damaging spell uh depending on who you're with i mean if you go early game with someone that you're playing with you can take the heal first but i usually go with the damage spell first just for the fact of it's it's faster to level up to begin with uh, she's gonna peel off looks like she's gonna go for one of the uh farms right there and I can peel back and help her because it's gonna give me a little bit of gold and experience and we can drop back into the lane no problem and hopefully that'll put it just that much further ahead of these guys just a little bit now early poke with this chick is uh, it's pretty decent we got two heavy ADCs down here that do most actually the highest damage output that there pretty much is for the game Currently, Bruno being the probably the strongest meta with Layla not far behind. Of course, I am support, so staying back behind your people is uh, probably a really good idea to begin with. And just you can reach on out there and use that ability, but make sure you have your heal up. That way, you can get back because it does increase your movement speed. Go pick up some more magic power, and this chick is staying lane too much. Uh, you need to draw back behind the tower protect it use that tower to protect yourself now since I am taking so much uh, or she is taking so much damage I'm going to level up the heal first and once we hit four we'll have the ultimate so let's sneak out here see if we can't do a little bit of damage to some of these guys got a good hit in on him that frost spell from her is pretty good it's uh, really useful to keep them at bay sometimes but they're pushing really hard on this bottom tower now mid lane looks fine. Uh, we're pushing top lane as well. I don't see anybody contesting her unless they got killed. So this mob over here is up. Now I'm gonna use my regen and we're gonna execute this guy. We're just gonna try to kill him. He's gonna die. Oh, we did, we saved Maya. Wow, that was uh, very surprising. I didn't expect to get her saved because she was just standing there. Uh, that was really odd. She just got killed because uh, she didn't go back. So now we're in the lane by ourselves. I have no mana. And we're just going to have to barely poke at it and uh, try and regain some mana. And hope this regains, regen spell comes up. Uh, I'm going to wait for the tower to uh, take all of them. There we go. Then just get in and uh, do some normal attacks. Uh, she's gonna try to get in and push some early damage as well Just like both of them have been doing. I'm gonna let them waste their mana. It's not really affecting me And I'm gonna go ahead and use my regen right when it pop, pops up and now we have more mana 
now i did have some people asking me about custom builds uh custom builds we might get into some of that with some of the later gameplays but the rank matches that we're doing right now i'm gonna wait on them and this chick is just relentless we could have caught her right there with that stun if she dips that close one more time i'm gonna catch her with that stun and it's gonna be all she wrote and let's go ahead and heal her up a little bit see he tried to come in she's staying too close all right we've got towers in i'm gonna go for it i'm gonna go for it i didn't get any support from maya she was messing with the other one and that's the bad part about playing with people that you can't communicate with which hopefully soon they'll have everything updated. I have heard that they are adding, I think, a... Uh, it's not voice chat yet, but it's, I guess, in-game chat that you can customize. So hopefully that will get the ball rolling for some things and uh, get some better people in here that we can play with. Now, she's going to overextend. She didn't have very much mana, and she needs healing as well already, so... Yeah, we just got pushed back. Oh, we got both of them right here under the tower. Come on, chick. Thank you. All right. We finally got one down right here. At one, zero, and one. Going to continue pushing. I'm completely out of mana, though. I just want the kill. Not the kill, but the gold off of that kill right there. And we're going to grab it. We're going to get some mana regen first because we are desperately in need of some mana. I uh, do not want to go back. We're just going to go ahead and pick this stuff up. I'm going to kind of work it out to where I don't have to go back. Because if I can stay and wait for the regen, I'll get to the point around a level 10 or 11 that I won't have to go back at all for mana. It's just, it regens so fast and I can carry people with it. And this healer is amazing to do that with. We're going to get two kills right here. Amazing at what you can do with a healer now this is the only support well not support but the only healer in the game currently which is uh it's not a bad thing but later in time once uh, they add the other characters that they're going to be adding you'll see about three or four other healer type or in a sense things that can uh support your teammates with uh, if you look on the actual Wii MOBA page, which is the actual Chinese version of this game, you'll see that yeah, it's there's a lot of heroes on there. All right, we have one that just transferred over, so I'm gonna jump in. We're gonna get a stun on her, and no. All right, so let's heal this person up, and we've got a regen spell, so we're gonna use it. Go ahead and pick some more mana back up. We're a few levels away from actually getting decent regen so we're gonna stay in here that way we do get the gold and I'm gonna check up on other lanes mid lanes towers down top lane towers down but nobody is up there in top lane this is not looking too good uh, Alice is pretty tough so I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade the heal and yeah we're definitely gonna transfer to that top lane now this is rank matches by the way uh we've been doing this series this will be the second one the first one was a maya we will uh we'll link that video at the end of this one along with the uh subscription stuff and one other random video for you guys to watch and let's see we need to actually this tower is already down so we can heal her that's a faker okay we got two of them on me all right i'm gonna have to stun I had no chance there. If I would have stunned a little bit earlier, I might have had a chance, but I didn't have any movement speed. And that slow from Bruno is pretty brutal. All right, it looks like they picked up on that top lane where I got caught out by that Bruno. So we're going to try to get to this Alucard before he does die. I know he does have a little bit of life, uh, life steal with his abilities. He did kill Bruno. So I'm going to jump in and help him out. He did not need my help whatsoever so we're gonna stay with him uh, this spell right here is 
buff. That one's actually pretty good for uh, a healer. That helps out with the mana quite a bit. And are we good? Uh, he's gonna he's gonna go back. He sees us coming, but hopefully we'll be able to take this tower. That guy just went in there and went ham on him. Okay, we're gonna easily take this tower. This guy's just gonna stand here and watch. They're both just standing here. What in the world is going on? So I'm gonna stun him, execute. Gonna get out of there. He got so close to dying. I'm not sure what this person is doing. It's I don't know if it's a uh, bot that's done taking over him and it's not doing very well. But the ultimate on this chick, once you level up, it comes down quite a bit. Um, you're able to basically get in Ooh, we need to back out actually yeah we're probably not gonna make it through this maybe oh he's dead he's dead he's dead oh yes he is I am dead too so we got caught out on that last one uh, the heal did not pop up in time so now we need to look for see if we can't find any of our other guys we did end up taking that top tower up there though so that's really good we got Maya over here on this right side pushing so let's come over here. Actually, uh, we're gonna attempt to kill one of these guys. Uh, I've never tried this by myself, but we're gonna try it anyway. She doesn't really do a whole lot of the auto attack damage, and here comes Maya. I really can't handle Maya by myself. I'm just gonna let that reset. I didn't really waste any uh, mana or anything messing with that, but I do not have any other assistance over here, so we're gonna kinda fall back and let's see if we can't regroup with some of our guys. Here comes Alucard up the middle. And we need to start taking some of these minions out and start pushing back on this. They got three of them in this one lane looks like, but if they get close to this tower, it's gonna be uh, not a very fun time for them. All right, here he goes. Got him. Let's catch him up. She's running. Oh, he barely missed her right there. So we're going to get a pretty good push on this middle lane. This tower is already down as well. So all we need to do is basically keep up in here. I'm going to get some attacks in on this tower while they have actually uh, used an interrupt spell on it to keep it from hitting you. Now I'm going to go stun her and we got the kill on her. Now I'm going to regen in the back heal myself up we do have a minion now we have some minions here and that's game that was a quick match uh, fastest match I've actually played in ranked in quite a while especially playing a support it was really nice to have some people that actually knew what was going on so we climbed up to elite two so far in ranked uh, which hopefully we will be pushing on towards the legendary title later on in the season uh, if you have any questions about Raffaella or about the game in general, just ask. Don't forget about the links in the description, guys. Make sure you download that app and also go over to Gleam once that is live and do register for those so you can have a chance to win that giveaway, guys. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Solvash. You guys have a nice day.